So what we have here is frozen char grilled veggies with all kinds of veggies in them from Morrison's. Uh, one pack of curry noodles with the sachet I put on there as well. I water fried and then we did use a tiny bit of oil for taste. Um, I shouldn't have to look up and say really that uh, I don't always have oil because it's my choice and it doesn't matter to anyone else really. It shouldn't do. My business, you know. But mainly we water fry. Uh, I used some uh, tin pineapple on there as well because I wanted pineapple. We have some hold hemp seeds and some Nando sauce which I've had for ages. It's like the huge... The biggest bottle you can get. And uh, it's, it's almost gone. It's lasted a long time. Because it's really hot and you don't need a lot when it's really hot. So p roll dinner check-in on Sunday. Am I missing anything out? Ah, yeah. The frozen char-grilled veg. And we have a frozen uh, cauliflower and broccoli in there as well. Usually about a pound a pack. Uh yeah, can't argue with that, can you? Look at it. Like a load of wriggly worms. They're just noodles, Michael. They're only noodles, Michael. And um, oh dearie me, how rude of me. I also forgot to include some frozen onions. And just as I've gone and done this other video to say what else was on here, I've just gone and forgotten what else I was going to say. Ah, yeah, that was it. Frozen veggies are good. You've always got something to eat. It's always there. And again, with the noodles as well, like all of that's pretty much sitting there ready to make a meal. Something has eluded my brain there. There was something else I was going to say. Frozen onions. What else was there, P roll? Aha! Yeah. See some of that? Some angelita. Always good to chuck on a meal. Not every meal though, I may add, but nevertheless good for on here, for those vits and B12 goodness. Throw it out and pee roll. Welcome to the amazing educational bonus section of P Roll's channel, which I am unique, which you will never see on any other cycling channel. Check it out such amazing architecture and here we have some frequency windows or are they buildings worldwide which were told were thrown up with men in horses and carts and buggies in just a few decades in the late 1800s and early 1900s of course they were the timelines don't fit p has been doing his research and listening to not mainstream academia because like a lot of things they violently oppose this theory but many buildings like this worldwide architecture in huge cities i can name so many sydney adelaide madrid brussels buffalo san francisco nyc even like edinburgh paris Anywhere in Spain, anywhere in the world, you name it, even China. Many buildings look the same. Very strange. Anyway, thanks for sticking by for the bonus section. P-Raw over and out.